welcome back to my channel it's your girl a zina williams how are you all doing hope you guys are good hope you guys are fine if you're new to this channel kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video okay guys today is the 32nd birthday of Maria Chike Benjamin. Yes, Mrs. Maria Chike Benjamin. Yes, guys, today is her birthday and she shared this cute, cute video with us to celebrate her birthday. I love, love it. Like, this video is everything and more. Yes, guys. Now, moving away from that, you see, in this life, it's good to fight for your rights. Yes. I mean, Fina is now lounging in the Maldives. Yes, guys. You all know how this babe spoke up, how she fought for her rights. Yes, guys. Well, she is reaping the rewards of her labor. Now, all those people that were like, oh, they will not give her. Oh, she should shut up. Oh, she should not do this. Where are you people now? Baby girl is in Maldives. Cut see how travel better. Of, of course, of course, it's part of her women's of the Big Brother Niger season 7 back in 2022. As she is enjoying this, her fans are still looking forward to her 1BTC. Ah, ah, quidas. Kilo Shele. Where is the 1BTC? Do not think that, okay, oh, because she is having fun in Maldives right now, she's not going to watch Remember You. She will. If she doesn't, her fans are already asking about the money so um multi choice i'm sure they are going to do the right thing talking about multi choice tomorrow is the last day for the audition of big brother niger season nine yes so you and your dynamic pair hope you guys have auditioned because the doors are closing on the 4th of may which is tomorrow and you know why i love may because it's that month in the big brother calendar where we get to start filming the reunion so if we're actually going to be having a reunion this year best believe that this is the month where they all will gather for the reunion and your girl mm -hmm, i'm ready for all the drama yes guys talking about drama um hmm. So, ex Big Brother Titan housemate Marvin decided to um, be gracious, you know, out of his own kindness, to get the winner of Big Brother and Zanzi, the one that has just concluded, an all expense paid trip. Yes, guys. And a lot of people were like, hmm, this one Marvin is offering this guy an all expense paid trip. What's, 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 what's the catch? I mean, because you can't just wake up and start offering somebody that you do not know. You know, you've, it's not like, okay, or somebody you've known from before, you know, that kind of all expense paid trip. Anyways, the drama here is the winner of Big Brother and Sansi said no. He declined. He said, you know what? I do not want this. You know, thank you so much for this, but no, thank you. I do not want this. And all um, more, the comments we are coming. People were like, yes, yes, MC Junior has finally done something that they love. You know that Marvin is a cloud chaser. He always loves to gum body with, you know, winners or previous winners of the show, BEBB Niger, B Brother Titan, or Big Brother South Africa. And now, I mean, MC Junior has said that he is not one for the public show or for the celebrity lifestyle. He just wants to, you know, be in his corner and do his thing. This has prompted um, Marvin, yes, to come out to say, okay, um, I didn't understand what this is all about. This is why I actually offered this guy an all expense paid trip. So guys, what we are going to do now is to watch the video and hear what Marvin has to say about this whole drama. Please watch and listen to him. So, so hence I said Nigeria. But bringing the person to Nigeria, I didn't plan to like use them for anything. You know what I mean? Of course, I shoot content, right? I shoot my vlogs, my daily vlogs. If the person wanted to be on the vlog, they can if they want to. You know, I always vlog, right? You guys like the vlogs. I always vlog. I always do content. If you want to be in it, you can. But the plan was, you no, know, come to come to Nigeria. I've done this before, right? I've done this before. Come to Nigeria, experience Nigeria, okay? This is like a way of the Titans, right? We had Nigeria and South Africa. 
So it's a thing of just inviting your brother or your sister to another country and they get to experience it. They get to enjoy the, the country, right? You have all expenses paid, okay? You have an opportunity to do your media rounds. Um, <clears throat> when Yaya came here, she did media rounds. You know, it's extra exposure, right? Um, you, get to see the, you get to see the city, you know, you get to enjoy the food, um, you get gifts from me because I actually plan to gift a person. Um, you know, you just do whatever you feel like. I actually plan to, the thing I was focused on was the media round for the person. So the person can really have that extra exposure, that Nigerian exposure. See? And I, I think it would have been good for exposure. Because you guys know me, I'm big on exposure. Like, that's the whole reason I went to Big Brother Titans was to have that exposure in Africa. And that's what I was thinking, really. Okay. Yes, guys. So that was Marvin reacting and, of course, explaining why he decided to gift the winner of the show that, you know, all expense paid trip. What are your thoughts? Do you think it's valid? Do you think that there's something fishy? Do you think that Marvin is a cloud chaser? You know, the pestering kind that always wants to, you know, um, you know how leeches always attaches themselves to something they can suck blood from? Do you think that's, that's who Marvin is? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Yes, guys. Now, away from some Big Brother Niger shenanigans or Big Brother world, let's talk about entertainment. Yes, Nollywood now um actress angela okore has come out to call out fellow actress messi johnson she put this whole write-up out on her incest story that a lot of us read but still were confused like you can see from that write-up she wrote a whole lot but still not a whole lot i don't know if that makes sense like she said a whole lot but really nothing that we can hold you know we can put our fingers to and what is all this? Like, my confusion is confused. What is her beef with Mercy Johnson? What has Mercy Johnson done? Reading all that, I am more confused after I read it before, to before I actually read it. Like, we all saw how she came out at um, Zuby Michael about the death of the late actor Junior Pope. We were all expecting her to come out, you know, with concrete evidence or something. Tell us something. Give us something. But she didn't, you know. At the end of the day, um, Zuby Michael later posted Junior Pope on his page, you know, and she also attacked him for it. And at this point, now we are all confused. Like, what exactly? is the problem like we all are waiting for Angela Okore to come out and tell us this is the issue this is what is happening now before I go talking about what is happening what is going on between Fina fans and Bella fans like ah uh, ah uh. so yesterday of course Fina started posting you know her mother's trip like I told you guys earlier and I don't know how it happened because I'm not going to sit here and tell you, oh, this is the party that started it or these are the fan base that started it. I will not do such. But I don't get it. I thought Fina and Bella are friends. So what is happening? What has, you know, what is this? Why are you guys on each other's throats? Let me know in the comment section. Well, that's it from me, guys. I said, okay, well, let me come and just you guys and let you know what is happening with your faves. Let me know your thoughts on all of the story in the comment section. On that note, I'd like to say a very big thank you to you all for being part of my channel. If you have not yet subscribed, kindly click on the subscription button. Click on the notification bell to let you know whenever I post any new video. Until I come your way again, I remain your dad. Darling girl, A.Z. Nee Williams. Have yourself a beautiful, wonderful day ahead. Bye, guys.